Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we will understand about the basics of constant voltage and constant current power supply. Okay, we will understand what is CV mode and what is CC mode in power supply. Okay, we will understand what is the difference between CV mode power supply and CC mode power supply. When and how a power supply enters in a CV mode and when and how a power supply enters in a CC mode, right? So I will explain it in a very simple manner and by in a single single slide itself, right? So you can see here uh, there is a two plane that is X plane and that is Y plane, okay? so by using this by using these two planes i will explain i will try to explain the the cv mode and the cc mode right cv stand for constant voltage and cc stand for constant current okay so you can see in the x axis there is a current limit which is called i set and in a y axis there is a voltage limit there is a voltage limit which is called V set. Okay, so let us say you have some power supply, and in that particular power supply, you have set some current limit that is I set, and you have some current limit that is V set, right? So let us understand now CV and CC mode. So you can see this is V set and this is i set if you further draw this you can see there is a point here there is a point here where your v set and i set is crossing together right so this point is called this point is called load crossover value this point is called load load crossover value and the the value of this resistance this the value of the load is called critical resistance okay so this point is having some load crossover value some load and that load is called the, the critical resistance and the value of load can be determined by using the formula here you have v set divided by i set okay this is called critical load or critical resistance or load crossover value rl right rl so rl you can calculate by using v set divided by i set right now let us understand what is cv mode so so you can see if your current is if since you have i set here if you are drawing your current within the limit of i set your power supply is running in cv mode right if you are drawing the current somewhere from here to here this is your current in y axis if you are drawing the current from here to here that means you are not crossing your current limit i set value that means your power supply is running in cv mode right so in the cc mode so in the cc mode if you're drawing if you're drawing the current beyond the current limit so uh, let us say if you're drawing the current more than your i set here somewhere here in that direction so at that po point of time your power supply enters in a cc mode so in a cc mode the the current is constant and the voltage fall down the voltage will dip right so so in the C, cv mode if your critical resistance value is if you if your load resistance value is greater than the critical resistance value okay and what is your critical resistance value your critical resistance value is given by V set divided by I set that means this resistance 
so if your load resistance value is greater than v set divided by i set that means your your power supply is in cv mode and if your critical resistance value if your load resistance value is less than less than v set divided by i set okay if your load resistance value is less than your critical resistance value that means your power supply enters in cc mode okay so there is a three things to remember here the first is the critical resistance value and how will you determine the critical resistance value or the or the critical load value that can be determined by v set divided by i set and what is the v set v set is the maximum voltage uh, limit and i set is the maximum current limit so by using this formula you can determine the value of critical resistance uh, right or uh, critical load resistance and now if you if your load resistance is greater than load resistance value is greater than the critical resistance value or v set divided by i set your power supply enters in cv mode and if your load resistance value is less than right uh, the critical resistance value that is v set divided by i set that means your power supply enters in cc mode so hope you understand the concept now i will consider one one uh, numerical here and i will explain how a power supply enters in cv mode and how a power supply enters in cc mode right so let us say in 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 this case we have v set equals to 50 volt right this value is 50 volt and i set equals to 0.1 ampere right so if you if you want to calculate the critical resistance value that is rl is equal to here this value you are calculating first v set divided by i set equals to 50 volt divided by 0.1 ampere that means your critical resistance value is 500 ohm right for this specification your critical resistance value is 500 ohm now let us say uh, as as i have already told you if the load resistance value is greater than the critical resistance value that means your critical resistance value here is 500 ohm now for this case let us say if your load resistance value is 600 ohm right so at that point of time if you want to calculate the current right that is equals to current equals to 50 volt v set divided by load resistance 50 volt divided by 600 ohm you can find this is 83 milliampere that means your power supply is working in cv mode that means your power supply is working in cv mode uh, so let us say if your current is in this area okay that in this area that means if you're drawing the current less than your i set value i set value is here 0.1 ampere and you're drawing a current of 83 milliampere that means at that point of time your power supply works in a cv mode and in a cv mode voltage is constant and current current is below the current limit right in in a cv mode voltage is constant and current is below the current limit right so now let us consider the second case when the power supply enters in cc mode so i equals to 50 divided by 400 ohm so in this case your your critical resistance value is 500 ohm so now you have you have your load resistance value is 400 ohm that means your 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 load resistance value is less than your critical resistance value right that means you are drawing 125 milliampere current from your load at that point of time your power supply enters in cc mode if you are drawing more current than your current set limit so so this is your current set limit that is 0.1 ampere 100 milliampere and you are drawing current somewhere here that is 125 milliampere so at that particular point of time your your power supply enters in cc mode 
and what happens you, if your power supply enters in CC mode? So, if your power supply enters in CC mode, constant current, constant current mode. So, in a constant current mode, uh, the current is constant and voltage fall below the 50 volt. So, if you are drawing current somewhere here, that is 125 milliampere, maybe you will have less than your fifth, less than your V set value. So your V set value is 50 volts. So for let us say for uh, you are getting 40 40 volt, right? So you are getting your voltage fall down and it could be 40 volt. So hope you understand what is the concept for constant voltage power supply and what is the concept for constant current power supply. If you have any question, feel free to ask me in comment section. Thanks for watching this video.